Hi friends, welcome back. We have a mo I married a prince, and this chapter is gonna get more dramatic. When is it possible that I got amnesia? So, anyways, let's go. Go follow that author on Instagram. No thanks. Thanks for telling me. You know, change your choice from the previous chapter. I'm still on Team Prince. Still, I'm with the story. Still on Team Prince. It's a miracle, really. Her Highness is showing signs of speedy recovery despite her injuries. But her memory? Yes, is it strange that her brain seems to have selectively wiped out all the memories of you? She remembers everything and everyone except you. I also have no explanation for that. Her Highness waking up is already unexplainable in itself. Sometimes it's just out of this world. But we'll definitely put her under close ob observation and attempt to get her. Get diagnosed over the next couple of days. All right, thank you. Please do do all you can to her, heal her. Of course. Are you feeling better? Yeah. You really don't remember me, huh? No. I'm trying, but every time I'm about to get something, my head will hurt like crazy. Please stop trying. It doesn't matter, Caroline. All I hope is for you to get better right now. You don't have to force yourself. We'll have plenty of time to jog your memory later. Besides, I can't be that forgettable. What is happening here? Many meetings later. Your Highness, the conference with Shanghai is in 10 minutes time. Oy. I'm so sorry you had to see that. Your Highness, I'm sorry for how tired you are. It's been three days since you had any proper rest. You've been working hard. You've been hard at work since our plan foiled. Back to back to back meetings, public addresses, social events. I'm surprised you haven't burned out. I know you're feeling guilty for what happened to His Majesty and Miss Caroline, but your health is important to me too. I'm fine, Louis. I have to do this. If destroying any influence David had and his cronies have is the only way to protect Carolyn and my father, I would dedicate my life to it. I'm not letting anything happen to them. Any news on Hit and Run? If there's any require, require any assistance or backing at all, then... Yes, it seems the investigators have a target in mind. Investigators are ongoing as we speak, but your highness... You have, a, you have more than enough on your plate. Let's leave the investigation to the professionals. How's my schedule like for tomorrow? You have an opening in the evening. Are you finally going to take a break? Something like that? I haven't visited Karen since she awoken. She, she seems so uncomfortable and awkward around me that I thought some space would do good for her. Plus, I gave her headaches. But yeah, if I need a little perk me up, her smile will do just a trick. Does our beloved Crown Prince William runs on batteries? In light of the recent abdication scare and incident surrounding the royal family, it seems like it's up to his, to his highness to pick up the broken pieces. Having just returned to his throne, he's been hard at work to regain the confidence of our people. Though it seems Callan is no longer by his side. Just what's going on, on, the, on in the royal household? Perhaps a reality show should be in the talks? In the talks? Rude. Are you watching the news again? It's all I can do since I've been stuck here. I'm bored. You need you need all the rest you need to recover, kiddo. Your injuries were not light. Hmm. You know, I get that he's really busy, but if he were really were my fiancé like he claims to be, he sure isn't as caring as I would like to be him to be. It's been three days and he hasn't visited at all. I'm I might not remember who he is, but he sure isn't trying, huh? Crap. Do I sound like a whiny brat?
I blame the accident. Not at all, Princess. My bad. I didn't know you would miss me that much. Had I known you were whining for me, I would have never left. Please tell me I'm hallucinating that you did not just hear that. Bury me. It'd be less painful. What happened now? I'm glad you're feeling better, Princess. You still don't remember me, huh? But I'm still con contented with how you still miss me despite that. I thought you were busy, really busy. Yeah, but I missed you. Hey, I know you're really bored here. What do you say we sneak out for a while? Spend some time with me might jog your memory a little. Couldn't have said it better myself. Oh, Henry's back. We both like to take you out for some fresh air, Caroline. And maybe jog your memory a bit. But you, you can only choose one of us. But I'm gonna stay in my room. I like to be alone. Turn both of them down. Before I go, can I do something? I sound absolutely cra crazy right now. I don't even know what I'm saying, but you you know those fairy tales you where a true love kiss solves everything? The guy ki just kisses the girl and everything magically falls into place? William? I love- I very much like to try that. What, what am I doing? I barely know him, or at, at least what I can remember about him, but this feels so right. <gasps> what the hell? Fairy Godmother? What are you go what's going on? What are you doing here? Oh, sh did she froze time? Cool. <laughs> That's so cool. What? Forgive me, child. That was a cruel trick to play. Call me psychotic or curious, but I really wanted to see how this would play out. How deep you look love for each other was. It's time for you to really wake up now. Oh, I'm dreaming! You've been asleep for three days, princess. Please wake up now. <laughs> Caroline? Did you see his face? You're real! You're, done. You're not just a dream. Were you dreaming about me all this while? I, I can't. I, I thought I forgot. It's okay, Princess. You're right now. Oh, that's it. Anyways, thanks for watching. Catch you guys next time on I Married a Prince, where I match got back memories, and let's see what happens in the next chapter. So next time, later.